Frank and Judy are regular lottery players. Over five years before they won, they purchased maybe two or three thousand dollars worth of tickets, whatever they could afford to lose that week. I can guarantee you that you will never win the lottery unless you have a ticket in your pocket. Someone might buy a, a lottery ticket, which has a very poor chance of paying off, and they might win. Well, that would be a bad decision with a good outcome. Ron Howard of Menlo Park, California, is a professional decision theorist. He helps people and corporations learn how to make better decisions. The fundamental distinction that you have to make is between the quality of the decision and the quality of the outcome or con consequences that follow from it. By buying 20 tickets, Judy tried to improve her odds of winning. Even though she won, buying a lot of tickets didn't help much. Buy one ticket in seven million chances, and you have a 99.99999% chance of losing. Buy 20, and your chance of losing is 99.99972%. At a dollar each, you would have to buy three and a half million different tickets to have almost a 50-50 chance of winning. The numbers are just too big to carry in your mind. So instead of figuring the odds, people trust in luck. I called Frank and I said, we're going to win tonight. I said, we're absolutely going to win the lottery tonight. And that, that is absolutely the truth. And she went through this stoplight business about, she went through seven green stoplights and none were red and, and that's why she was going to win the lottery. And I said, sure, Judy, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. And he, so he did not believe me. The experts say hoping to beat huge odds is a natural but troublesome human tendency. Barbara Mellers is a psychologist who studies how people make decisions. If we believe we can control uncertainty out there that's completely out of our hands, we're apt to make all kinds of poor decisions. It was just meant to be. It was fate. At lottery odds of 7 million to 1, you are more likely to appear on a late night talk show, to spend time in jail, to be killed by a dog, to become a millionaire on your own, or be struck by lightning. <laughs>